Hello friends. In this video, we are talking today. We want to explain about an Iranian fast attack boat. Its name is Zulfagar and belongs to IRGC Naval Force. We will simply cover history, features, missions, and other things. First, know the name Zulfagar comes from Imam Ali's sword. Iran often chooses historic or religious names for its weapons. Zulfagar is one of those famous names with deep meaning. This boat was built for fast and asymmetric operations at sea. Zulfagar was inspired by North Korean fast boat called IPS. Those boats arrived in Iran in early 2000s years. Then Iranian naval industry started making their own local version. The result became this Zulfagar boat we now often see. Its design is very simple, but also smart for higher speed. The hull is slim and narrow to glide smoothly on water. Lightweight materials like composites were used in its construction carefully. This makes it less visible on enemy radar detection systems. The boat length is around 16 or 17 meters long. Its width is about 3.5 to 4 meters. Draft is less than 1 meter, so it enters shallow. Overall weight is nearly 14 tons with full equipment carried. The power comes from two strong diesel engines installed on board. Combined output is something above 2,400 horsepower. Because of that, the boat can reach very high speed. Its maximum speed is nearly 95 kilometers per hour. The operational range is almost 570 kilometers distance. That means without refueling, it can travel quite a way. This matters for patrol missions and sudden attack type operations because it gives more time before needing to return back. Main weapons of Zulfagar are two Iranian anti-ship missiles. These missiles are usually Kausar or Nasir made locally. Their maximum range is almost 30 kilometers in basic versions. They were designed to strike small or medium naval vessels. Besides missiles, the boat also carries heavy machine guns. Two 12.7 millimeter guns are installed on board, one in the front and another in back. They defend against close threats and small targets around them. Navigation and radar systems are also fitted inside this craft. Its radar can detect surface targets up to 30 kilometers. That helps the crew to find targets more easily. Navigation equipment is Iranian-made, simple but also quite reliable. In recent years, a new updated Zulfagar was presented this version can carry short-range air defense missiles on board. The system is called Nawab and made for protection. So the boat can even defend against enemy air threats. The air defense model has four vertical launch missiles. This feature is unique among fast boats around the world because rarely do navies put such systems on small craft. It shows Iran is seeking mixed defense and offensive power. No clear record exists of Zulfagar fighting in real combat. Mostly it has been used in drills and exercises. But its role is mainly in group swarm attack tactics. Several boats together attack and confuse large enemy naval ships. One interesting event was exporting these boats to Venezuela country. Around seven units were delivered in year 2021. Venezuelan Navy renamed them as PACAP-3 class locally. They were seen in parades and naval drills over there. In year 25, Venezuela also deployed them during tensions. That was when Britain entered region and Guyana had dispute. The exported Zulfagars were stationed across the Caribbean waters that period. It showed Iran also tries selling weapons to foreign buyers. Exact numbers of Zulfagar inside Iran are never announced publicly, but clearly a few units serve operationally with IRGC fleet 
because they appeared many times in Southern exercises on media. So numbers are not huge, but still more than handful. These boats can be stored inside underground IRGC naval bases. Those hidden bases are built under mountains to protect equipment. This gives safety and survival chance for small fragile boats. Zulfagar is also part of that underground hidden fleet. Foreign analysts describe Zulfagar as a small fast strike boat. They say design looks similar to North Korean IPS versions. They emphasize its role is quick, surprise hit, and run. The idea is enemy has little time to react. Some reports suggest Zulfagar may carry Chinese-style light missiles. It might even use small torpedoes under special modified designs. That would make swarm tactics of IRGC even more effective. Because then, each boat carries more weapon variety on board. Western articles note Iran keeps producing, despite many international sanctions. Zulfagar is shown as an example of Iranian military independence. It is often displayed during exercises as symbol of capability. Especially in Persian Gulf and Hormuz Strait, it plays importance. Another interesting part is a submarine-style Zulfagar was built. That version could dive underwater like a small light submarine. It could even fire 324 mm torpedoes. The aim was secret and special missions near enemy waters. This amphibious model is sometimes called Zulfagar torpedo launching version. It was delivered to IRGC Navy around year 2015. Very few details were shared officially and most remain classified. But its presence shows Iran wants wide variety of designs. Another unusual thing is that air defense on fast boat. Normally, navies never place surface-to-air missiles on craft. This Iranian step shows combining both defense and attack together. Zulfagar with that system became very different from other models. Overall, Zulfagar is a light, fast, and dangerous small vessel. It is not built for direct duel with large destroyers. But for harassment and exhausting bigger navies, it works effectively. This reflects Iran's typical asymmetric warfare naval strategy at sea. So, let's summarize. Zulfagar is one unique Iranian naval boat. From design to export and updated versions, it traveled a long way. For IRGC, it is an important sea weapon continuing forward. That was our simple talk about Zulfagar boat for you.